6, an official vote behind closed doors to determine whether the Contra Costa County DA will be out of a job. KPX 5's Juliet Goodrich live outside the DA's office in Martinez with the latest on this no confident vote. Jules? Veronica, this vote happening late today. We're talking about the board members, and its union, comprised of more than 88 members, voted a majority no confidence in their DA here in Contra Costa County. Here's the latest now from the union's president. Today, the members said that they have no confidence in Mr. Peterson by majority vote of our membership. Is this a first for the county? Has this ever happened before? To my knowledge, this is unprecedented in the Contra Costa County District Attorney's Office history. And that's because it's reserved for the worst of the worst. Contra Costa County DA Mark Peterson has already agreed to pay a hefty fine for spending his campaign money on personal expenses. In total, the California Fair Political Practices Committee found that the DA spent more than $66,000 of campaign contributions on travel, hotels, restaurants, and movie tickets. Peterson admitted he was guilty, repaid his campaign, and paid an additional $45,000 fine to the commission. But today, he's paying the price again with this latest no confidence vote. And this vote is for every member of our community who is concerned and wants to get justice. It's for our victims who want jury, juries to be able to judge their cases free of distraction from Mr. Peterson. And it's for the criminal defendants who wonder why one standard applies to the district attorney and another applies to them. Aside from a written statement admitting he broke campaign finance rules hundreds of times, the DA hasn't been willing to talk since December. And today, Peterson was not in his office before, during, or after the vote. And it doesn't end here with this no confidence vote. In fact, the court will appoint a special prosecutor to review this case. And should he be found guilty, convicted, he will be asked to step down immediately, remove from office. But many people today are calling for his resignation ASAP. In Martinez, Juliet Goodrich, KPIX 5.